Chicago O'Hare International Airport, 25th of May 1979. American Airlines Flight 191 is a DC-10 getting ready for a flight from Chicago to Los Angeles. In command of the jet is 53-year-old Captain Walter Lux. Captain Walter Lux is much experienced on DC-10s. First Officer James Dillard is less experienced. He is 39 years old and has very little time flying DC-10s. The flight engineer is Alfred Udovich. He is the flight engineer who will keep charge of all hydraulic readings and all the, and all the other gauges at the back of the aircraft. Chicago O'Hare International Airport Tower gives the all clear for flight 191 to take off. There's a loud explosion. And there's a massive meters away from the airport. Everyone on board, and including two people on the ground, die in the crash. There are two ground injuries. There was also, as there was also discovered by the NTSB, that the plane's hydraulic fluids were spilling after the plane had taken off. It had been found out that the left engine had somehow fallen off the aircraft. And to this day, it still remains a painful memory for those who lost their lives in this crash, as it was one of the worst crashes in American history. Thank you.